Hello everybody, uh, Magix here, back again with some more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Uh, we'll be continuing with the story, I believe, today. We've got to go and speak to the king, if I'm not wrong. Uh, I think the game had an update uh, since the last time I recorded, but I'm not 100% sure what it did, if it had an update. Uh, but yes, yeah, so we're going to continue playing, uh, and we'll just see where we go with it. I'm going to try and focus a little more on uh, adventuring through the story today, uh, as well as, you know, looting everything, trying to get some more wealth around the places and whatnot. I want to try and collect all the wealth in uh, the county, I guess it would be, the county that we are in now before obviously we move over to England. I do believe that in the future we come back to do the power level 265 area. But it would be cool to get a lot more wealth because that will help us with uh, England. Um, so yeah, ho hopefully we can do that. Uh, that will be that will be quite cool to be able to work towards that. But even if we don't get everything, uh, you know, any little mysteries or anything we find along the way can still be useful. Like we found the uh, the sleeping one the other day, where the guy managed to wake up in the middle of the air going down a, a tightrope or zip line or whatever it was. So yeah, we're going to go ahead, everything seems to be loading in, that's why all the textures look plastic. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll go speak to the king. They must be finished now. The king has called for his best mead, so the talks are concluded. It should be safe to enter. I'm ready to face the thunder. I'll speak with the king now. Excellent, King Stephen. I will take this proposal to my nephew. I believe he will see the wisdom in it. Good. It is all I can hope for. May the... May the winds favor your voyage, Githormer. Eivor, come forward and explain in plain words why you have willfully disobeyed my commands. Do you mock me? I do not mock you, King. I mean to embolden you against your enemies and your own poor judgment. You know nothing of my judgment. You know nothing of my plans and strategies. Sigurd would agree with me. My son might agree with you, but he would obey me. He knows his place. Not as well as he knows his father. Imagine you are harassed by an enemy with warriors that vastly outnumber your own. What profit does open war bring? Would it not be better to work quietly through diplomacy, gaining alliances, waiting until the day our numbers outweigh our enemies and our victory is guaranteed? Do we have any allies? I don't want to call them cowardice. Or is that your excuse to do nothing? Day and night I toil to forge ties with plans to the north. Very soon you will see the fruits of my efforts. Only then will you understand. Is that all? I'm at a loss with you, Eivor. When I took you in as my own, never did I imagine such disrespect from the child of Mary. Your father was a fine man, just and loyal to me. He died bravely so that we might live. He died a coward, Lord. A fate I will not mirror. Why do you carry such a useless burden? Let it go. Think only of the days to come, of your future and the victories at hand. My honor has been stained. Until it's wiped clean, I want nothing else. Hey, Sigurd's back. Sorry about the yawn. Uh, tad bit tired. No, not extremely, but a little bit, a little bit. It says bonus content has been unlocked. 
Ah, these are the uh, materials that I bought probably about three or four weeks ago now. Uh, so I'm happy they're here. We're going to put a lot of them into the quiver and rations. Uh, but I'm going to look at these skills first. So we didn't go down here because it was melee. Uh, range, light attack, stealth. We'll do stealth. And range. And that unlocks what? It looks like an arrow. Uh, guided arrow, you must... That's insane. Uh, poison. Poison damage build up. Evasion ability. Can we. Uh, range light attack. Okay, I don't want to venture off too far this way. Actually. No, yeah, okay, I'll, we'll, we'll go this way a little more. What else can we get? Melee. What's this? That could be cool free kills on them. Can I not do that? Oh, I've got zero. <laughs> I've got zero skill points. It doesn't matter anyway. Uh, we'll also go to the codex first. So that's the king and that is the blacksmith that we currently have. Almost two years abroad. The king's son Sigurd. Oh yeah, so that's, that's what we're going to look at just after this. Anyway. Collectibles. Oh, we get cool decorations. Awesome. Yeah, we have so many of these now. So I'm going to upgrade this as much as possible uh, so that we can. Oh, wow. Uh, fabric. Okay, I think since these aren't exactly high level or anything yet. Evasion. See, that has higher evasion, but less everything else. Apart from H res. So I'm going to go with this. We also get. Okay. At low health, getting hit temporarily. When high life, successful hits have a chance of increasing attack. Increase speed when taking damage until you heal yourself up to five times. Ah, actually. I'm going to take these. A, they look super cool. B, jeez. Uh, I believe these are from the store? Question mark. Possibly. I'm not sure. What two legendaries do not we have? Uh, do we not have? It's just this one and this one, I believe. Uh, but yeah. Okay, one sec. We'll we'll look at the uh, the second hand stuff after. We want the berserker set complete. Lower speed, higher attack, less, uh, higher stun, and the same weight. And it also has more upgrades and room slots. Can we put anything? No. Nothing in there yet. Okay. That's awesome that we got a bunch of, uh, of gear from something. Oh, I can also compare. <laughs> I don't need to flick between them. Right, so this is where we have the axe. So... See this one, it has. Ah, so we have Barons, right? It has higher speed, less attack, less stun, higher crit pre, and less weight. Hmm. So that could be a good choice. This one has lower attack, uh, lower. Speed, same weight. That's a sort. Ooh, that is two handed though. And it's also slower. 
Okay, so we want to look at the the weapons. Ah. Okay, so I don't think we want this. I think I'm going to keep Varen's just for now because none of apart from these two which have the uh higher Hmm. I'm going to take the tusk, only because it allows us to add more runes and stuff, and this the difference isn't that great. It has one more attack for one less speed, and everything else is the same. Even though I don't want to focus on speed, um, we're still going to go with the other one. And then this, so we want to go for another shield, for definite. So equip that and we'll compare so what did I have that one so it's definitely between these two so which one do we have currently the Kraken see I'm tempting to go with this one because it has higher speed it has less attack and a lot less block too but we're not going for high block because we're going to try and not be use that eh, not using that increase melee damage when blocking increase attack okay I'm going to go with that just for now now we'll also increase our rations a little bit there we go and then because of this I do want to actually upgrade my bow and we'll upgrade that to level 4 and I think that's as far as we'll be able to go yes okay now we have no runes for that rune of rage extra attack yes we'll take that off Theron's attack so now we have an extra let me do the math 5.6% attack or 5.6 attack that's awesome okay I'm gonna have to see where I got all of that from but that's fine uh, what if I upgrade armor evasion armor evasion evasion armor okay so they all seem to do the exact same I'm going to upgrade them all to level 2 if I have enough, which I believe I should do. And then I'll also upgrade that to level 2 and that can't be upgraded yet. That's fine. Can we upgrade anything for any of these? Extra health. I'm actually going to put that on here. And then stealth will put on the hood. I don't know if it makes a difference. I, I doubt it, but you know that makes our rooms make sense. We've got the the main body armor for health, and then the hood for stealth. Awesome. We look cool. Right. Ah, now we have three. Uh, health potion. I don't know if anyone saw that. I also can't hit H at the moment. But anyway, well, that's that's awesome. That's a little uh, well, that's a pretty awesome and sick uh, upgrade boost. I don't know why we got it or how we got it even, but I mean I'll take it. You know, free upgrades for me, I guess. And there is Sigurd himself. I don't know what's going on with the graphics. Uh, my hair's also a, a super mess. So. Oh, look at you, blood so Why have you been worrying with them? Ah, and you, salt your big finger. <laughs> I smell the stink of a dozen kingdoms in your beard. It's just a start. <laughs> Brantley, my dear wife, your husband returns. Bringing gifts. Riches to share. And new friends, I see. Yes. Basim and Hytham. 
They look like the uh, the traditional assassins, of course. For his invitation and eager to pay tribute to your king. My brother is always very careful with the company he keeps. If you're standing safely beside him, he must like you. Save the introductions until our bellies are full. I will see my father. Tell him of my time away. This morning we traded with a ship passing south. They told us Avor the I really do not know why I'm skipping death. so many friends. They frames. must have cut the tail short. I killed my captors and recovered my crew. For that your father scolded me. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war. Own and add-ons in the store. It might be because they're trying to... Ah, so this is what it is. It's all the uh, season pass stuff and... You know. Uh, okay, okay, that makes sense. So that's all because I got the season pass. So I get everything from here, I believe. And then obviously all the properties and utilities are obviously extra. So that's... no. Nope. That's the one that I got twice. Uh, but yeah. Ooh. Oh, none of those are fiber, I don't think. Right, we'll we'll give it a second. That's probably why it's it's causing issues. Because it's trying to load everything that we've just got locked, so it shouldn't take too long. But yeah, that's awesome. Uh, I actually didn't get that in my last playthrough. Which is a bit strange. Uh, because, well, I was expecting to get it in the last... Um, I got the season pass at the start of the game. And from that, I was obviously expecting to get all the gear and stuff from it. So it was just a bit a bit weird when I didn't get it. Right, I'll keep an eye on the frames. It seems to be doing a tiny bit better. You know where I stand, brother. Nothing short of war will dislodge Chothbit from our lands. So I'm going to hope that it was just an issue with load and everything. But I might have to move the graphics down even more a little bit. We look cool with all of our bear gear and stuff. My son, welcome home. Father... Is that it? Oh, no, we'll give you. Feast and celebrate your return, Sigurd. The tables are laid with barley and lamb, bread and mead. And no more, I beg you. I want nothing you would not serve a thrall. Let me be the one to honor you. I bring gifts and tales from faraway lands. After two winters away, I am full up with both. Very well, very well. Come inside. And when we are fat and satisfied, we will talk of Kyotre and his clan, and how we may end their terror once and for all. He has dogged us too long, shamed us for too many seasons. I know this. Eivor knows this. It ends now. Yes, of course, when the time is right. <laughs> I like the little nod we did. You know, he was like, we know this, everyone knows this. We were just like, yeah, I know this. We barreled down the Volga River, raiding as we went. Shadowy tribes hurling spears at our ship. At Niklagard, we saw men bedecked in riches as vibrant as the Bivrest itself. And these we took for our troubles, of course. We sailed to Rome, then Africa, past oceans of sand, warriors of all colors, and beauty the eyes must weep to behold. And now I have returned. With riches and glory to share with my family, my friends, my eyes for Strengir. So take what you desire from my horn. For this, this is only a taste of things to come. Tomorrow, the Raven Clan starts a new skull, Sigurd. Skull! And you, Eivor, come. I have something special for you. There are others to speak with. Okay, so we have to speak to all the other people with the with the dots above the head. One second now. I am quickly. Ah, uh, no, not that. I want to check. There we go. This is what the map should have looked like before. Uh, it won't let me back out, which is a bit weird.
who ah these two. So Hitham and Basim with a I can't pronounce that second half. So these two are the kind of assassins from like Assassin's Creed instead of Vikings and we learn some stuff from them in the future which is uh, pretty cool. But yes. But anyway, back to the map. This is what it should have looked like. Uh, when it, it wasn't before, which was obviously strange, but now I have all of these Which are I can't tell you because I don't know <laughs> But now we see that there are Well Yeah, so now we see the wealth points which are all the ones in gold the mysteries are the blue and also possibly the uh, like I don't know, I think it's like the, uh, I think it's like a Scottish pattern, but it might not be, I might be wrong. Uh, but yeah, so we can hopefully go through there. We've also got one artifact. That might be an artifact, maybe. I'm not sure. But there are things that we can, we can learn. But yeah. So, sorry about that. So from there, we can obviously unlock all the little things in adventure all this part of the map below this uh this black line here and we can unlock all this stuff which then means we'll be able to get stuff in the later game much easier again i do apologize for yawning i am absolutely knackered but uh, i got some free time to record so i thought i'd i'd jump down record a little bit Sigurd spent his last two winters here, in Thornburg. Defending our lands, we must have been rid of Kjotve by now. You always said we needed more warriors to fight Kjotve. And for warriors, we need wealth, which Sigurd has brought us. The wealth he brings will not buy us an army. It only buys us time before our end. You talk like a man with one foot in Helheim. Have you no plan of your own to rid this land of our enemy? Will it fall to Sigurd and me? I do, but it will fall to you and Sigurd to accept it. And I must have your word that you will. If you so order it, my king, it will be done. You have my axe until the end. Hmm. We shall see. He doesn't trust us very much, I don't think. Also, just noticed, I can't pull up my mouse, but, like, I don't know how this is going to work. Right there, where my bow is, if you look kind of underneath the shield, you can see it's like a it's like a tree with some metal on it. It's got a pretty cool texture and like design of it. Well, it's got polar bear on our shoulder. <laughs> we just broke his face. Looks like a little little tiny polar bear. So we have to speak to everybody else uh, before we speak to Sigurd. Well, we can speak to everybody else before we speak to Sigurd. Randy, Eivor, have you paid a visit to Volka? I did. Um, it's not something I can speak on wish to. I understand. Your bed will be warm tonight with your husband returned. That must be a good feeling. It is a different feeling. Warmer, but with less space to stretch my arms and legs. Are you not happy to see your husband return? Of course. But it has been so long he seems a stranger to me. Three winters we are married and he has been away for two. Can you not rekindle the flame that once burned hot? When he crawls into bed to warm me, as you say, it will be with farts and honeyed breath. Ah, we should all be so lucky. <laughs> that was brilliant. Appreciate it. My guy's bringing us people and, and wealth and Hytham, everything. Yes, and you are able. I am. I hope this ruckus does not overwhelm you. We tend to drink and talk at equal speed. Not at all. The wood smoke from your fire pit does sting the eyes, but the warmth is welcome. Of course. It must be rather warm where you live. Where I live changes from week to week, but always I am with my mentor, Basin. Your mentor? For what cause? A noble one. A cause as true as the world is old. But let us leave it at that for now. I understand. But if you hope to stay tight-lipped for the rest of the night, keep clear of Tekla's meat. <laughs> ah, thank you for the warning. It will not be a problem. Okay, so we don't want to speak to 
Sigurd, who we want to speak to? Is that Bassim? Bassim. <laughs> Close. <laughs> Close. Can I fix that? Sigurd spoke often of you on our journey. Called you his right arm. A celebrated warrior. I am honored to meet you. Likewise, Bassim. And how did you come to meet my brother? He sat down in Constantinople some months ago to rest and resupply, he told me. But I knew otherwise. Men with eyes that gleam like his are always up to something more. I think he wished to raid the Hajj of Sophia. That sounds right. I will not bore you with the details of our meeting. But I liked your brother from the first. I saw something in him that captivated me. As if a forgotten memory of an old friendship had suddenly resurfaced. He has that effect on people. Enjoy your evening, Basson. Great. So we spoke to every... Yeah, that's just gonna sit. We spoke to everybody else. Uh, cool little conversations there. We'll go see what Sigurd wants now. You have snared my curiosity, brother. What is it? Not yet. Drinks first. I'll out drink you too. My first night in Pornberg in over two winters. It must end with me soaked and wall eyed, shouting at the shadows of trolls. And you want me to sail with you on these honey waves? Yes. You are stuck with me, Dringo. Now drink. We'll drink. Told you. Didn't have to do anything else because I drank you. Forgive me. On your first day back, I should have let you win. <laughs> you should have let me start. It is good to have you back, Sigurd. Yes. I've missed this terribly. When I first met Basin, I regaled him with tales of our homeland. This brings us to your gift. These excellent men were my shepherds through much of their homeland, the Abbasid Caliphate. They are a clan not joined by blood, but by a common idea. A brotherhood of shadows executing their own form of justice. The Assassin's Creed. They shared many of their most hidden secrets. For this I am grateful. I gift one of these secrets to you. A weapon of the finest warrior I know. Mind your finger. I think it did look offended, so I we'll is not amused, it seems. Am I not worthy of this gift? It is not about words, Eivor. It is a matter of devotion to our creed and... and training. Please. Mentor, I must protest. This is deeply unorthodox. Our wrist blade is a sacred Do tool. Do make a fetish out of cold metal, Haifa. What matters is the mind of the one who wields it. Please, try it on. Gladly. The blade should ride on the underside of your arm. Conceal it from your target. I have no wish to hide this, and I would rather not make the same mistake you two have. I like it. This is no mistake. This is a voluntary sacrifice to prove our devotion to a good start, Eivor. But you must learn how to use it effectively. Outside. This is not something for all eyes. Ooh. Ooh. It unlocks the, uh, the hidden blade. That's a really pretty one. Those guys seem to just have kind of dull ones. I guess they did want to hide theirs. We've kind of... Yeah, you see. Theirs are just kind of the same colour as their dress. Ours sticks out. Indeed. But among the tenants of our creed is a vow to never reveal 
too much to outsiders. In time, you may learn more. Not here, where the walls and trees may have ears. I look forward to it. Here, let me lead you through our most basic techniques. Wielded with skill and care, a blade delivers a singular keen <coughs> blow. As you near your target, find your window to strike. Timing is essential. Nicely done. Awesome. I have not seen a blade so sharp. Some targets are trickier than others. Keep that in mind before you strike. A decent attempt. Okay. <laughs> one down from the ledge. Which one? That one. Ah, no, we want to climb up here. And then assassinate. Ooh. Perfect. This is uh, a lot of what we're going to focus on throughout the playthrough. Yeah, we're going to focus a lot on this. You know, the stealth of it and, and assassinating the uh, harder enemies, which is why if I go back to skills, question mark. Okay, <laughs> I, don't, I was trying to find the... Uh, the hotkey for it. Yeah, so we're going to focus a lot on this. Anyway, that's going to help us with... Where is it? This one. So we're going to have to focus on, obviously, timing. But uh, So the ones that were overwhelming, that means they will be easier to attack, I believe. Uh, which means we should be able to get away with more murder. Fun. Take your time with hidden blade. Use your surroundings when possible. Strike from that haystack, for instance. A perfect strike. Wonderful. Take your time with the hidden blade. Mentor, you join us? Not why offer such a blame? Surely we have more. Hide. Hush. You wield the blade well. Let us leave Eivor to enjoy her gift in peace. Come. Oh, okay. Eivor, let us walk to the docks and take in the night air. I guess I'm going to assassinate you like this. Return to Sigurd. Okay. One more. One more. Nice. Perfect. What do you Come on then, let's go. Friends. They seem generous and menacing in equal measure. I know what you mean. They have learning too. They wield numbers and writing as if it were magic. Basin has shown me so much about the world, all of which I will share with you when the time is right. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> in theory, we have followed him here to speak with him. We can now leave, not speak with him, and then at any point he will just stand there for days on end and and wait to speak to us. Okay. I guess it wouldn't be days on end because the night would never kind of cycle. It would stick us here. Have you returned for good, or do you mean to join the Shadow Brotherhood? Leave all that aside. Tonight we are family again. The here and now is what matters. Our kinship. Our clan. Our glory. I missed you, brother. Your clear head and your courage. We have not had enough of both in recent months. You flatter me, old kids. Keep it up. From here to Valhalla, I will always be at your side, Sigurd. Always. This fjord has grown too small to contain me. For I too large. There is so much more beyond these stony fangs that rise around us. England, Ireland, Francia, all greener pastures, ripe for the plucking. Tomorrow, we make new war with Jufre and reclaim the lands he took from us. From there, we build a kingdom for us. I'm with you. Only say the word. Get some rest and return here first light. 
awesome. So I think now we're able to go to England, but I do want to explore a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> I'll try and get some more wealth. Uh, I think I'll get all four synchronization points. Uh, I don't think that allows us to fast travel back from England. Uh, but that means we can fast travel around and try and grab, you know, the closest wealth to whichever one we go to. So we were thinking about the uh, the blackout that we had, obviously last. Ooh, that's not good. Kill points. Do we want to kill him? Or? This one would not have come alone. I should find the others. <laughs> that was clean. So our quest at the minute is Ivern's Eivor, sorry, and Sigurd bleed Kjotve's lands to draw him to a, into a final fatal showdown. Nice. Okay, so which one did we want to go to? I'm thinking go towards this because we get extra melee and health, and then we'll be able to do this and then move towards the guided arrows. Yeah, I also think. Ah, uh, but that gives us higher evasion. So I don't know which one to go for. What's our evasion looking like? 11, 11. Ah, okay, so. Uh, our evasion isn't great, um, and we already have the assassination and a fair amount of range and melee damage. So I'm going to go towards the poison, which I have to, and then the evasion, only for the added evasion points that we're going to need, obviously, in in the future. Does it? Not, no, that doesn't show us anything. Show me. Okay. Okay, so we want to kind of go this way. Is that them? How many are there? Just the one? It does look like just the one, uh, but there could be some more around. But now at least we know where they are. So we'll make our way up, see if we can assassinate them too. That would be cool. You know. Oh, what is our quiver? 18 arrows. Great. <laughs> that was... I think that's quite a fair amount more than what we could uh, hold before. However, I'm not completely sure. What is this? Oh, it's a tree. Okay. Nice tree, I guess. But yeah, so on the map, I'm going to try and unlock... How many more synchronization points do we have? We have one here. Uh, none up there in Horde of Falk. Uh, so yeah, we have two more synchronization points. One is close to here, so we could go here, call the boat, travel here, and then go... We can also check out what that is, synchronize. And then from there, we can fast travel back here, boat, uh, ride, and then see how far we get so can we I don't want to do it from that ledge what that wasn't the plan that wasn't the plan I wanted to assassinate him yes but if you look in the bottom left uh, oh, H it's not going to let me do it now. Oh, there's another one. Cast about this land, my friend. Ah, I see. I didn't see him. Yay. Assassinate. Yeah. Wait, no, we wanna we wanna see what they have to offer. I can't even go in the tent, however. 
You got these instructions. Tell me what you see and how many ships, worries, and supplies. Also, note visits from Yarls and other important people. Ah, the important people probably being the uh, two assassins that we just found. Oh, can we go down there? Are we gonna? Oh, we can drift. <laughs> One sec, I'll have to drift my eyeball. Pretty sick. But yes, we want to go reach Sigurd. So they were trying to scout us out. Wow. That was rude. Parkour, as you do. We got so many people. I speak as your king, Sigurd, not your father. Bye, people. I'm going to call you back in a minute. You will be king of nothing if you do not act soon. They're arguing. It's not great. Until we cut off this serpent's head, it will poison us day by day, drop by drop. The poison has already polluted our waters. Gods, Eivor, what happened? Spies in our camp. Three men sent by Kjotve to kill us as we slept. I returned the favor. I'm covered in blood. This is what waiting brings. Nice. We must answer this insult. They came from Notfall, that wailing village under Chuckle's control. We hid him there. Burn it down before Kyrtle learns his spies are dead. He may have sent more. I can search the village while you round up the crew. No need. I will send Hytham to search the area. You can rely on him while we are away. We? Do you mean to join us? I don't like how sketchy they're being. I don't trust like this, but I will not stop you. <laughs> Me neither. Do not like it. Not a fan. Oh, he means of the raiding the village thing. I mean of those guys being super secretive. I don't like it. It's scary. Lead my son to the same storm that follows you. But I don't, I don't want to do this now. Okay, okay, we'll do this. Take command. Is it, is it just you two rowing? It's, it's just you two rowing. Through the waves. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Ah, in all fairness. They are... Oh. Okay, we are a little close to the 45 minute mark, uh, but I'll I'll do this this raid. I'm pretty sure we kind of just raid the village, um, so we'll we'll we we'll do that. Way out. That's fine. We don't need to follow the sail. We Save need to go to the raven. quest. No stories. See, now the frames are fine, kind of, but before, when I was taking, like, command, they were all jittery. I honestly don't know what's going on. I'm going to have to have a look in the, uh, the game settings again, see if everything's okay with my computer. My computer might just be having some sort of, yeah, you see, it's, it's, it's gone again. It's kind of really jittery. It's, it's really annoying. It's not just going to re uh, record either, it's, it's happening to the game. But there, like obviously I'm rendering in the trees, the mountains, the ships and everything and it's taking forever to render. I will show the way as you must lead us there. Oh, hey boy. I missed having you at my side. How I wish I could have taken you along on my travels. Stevian did not trust fate with both our Usually I've got water, but uh, I got pink lemonade. We are unstoppable. It's not too bad.
What's, what's going on? There is no sun. Okay, we'll switch to skies. Let's go. Ah, I, I know what mission this is. I need to make sure that I... <laughs> so the last time that I actually did this one, I uh, managed to set myself a light a lot. My aim. My aim. My aim. I've missed him because I've hit my own guy. My aim. Nice. My <laughs> guys, get out of the way. <laughs> get out of my way. <laughs> Ouch. Hold T to equip all. Take loot. Ah. See, I don't want to. I want to do this. Yay. Hmm. Fun. What was that? My game is having some serious issues. I'd love to know why, uh, but I don't. Ah, and again. Just keep shooting my own guys. <laughs> Burn. Yay. I think I have too much fun with uh, with fire and flames in this game. Yay. Is that one? There's also one up here and then one up there. And then I'm going to raid this. I do know that there are a few collectives over here. However, I don't think I'm going to get them just yet. Okay, I mean, you, you can burn. I don't mind that much. But yeah. So I'm, I, I know that there are a few uh, decent collectibles that we can get around here. Get them. Oh, I got flame arrows. Awesome. But I'm gonna not... Uh, yeah, so there are collectibles around here. Because I know there are. Uh, I'm just not going to grab them. Like, for example, that... Uh, I believe that's a book of knowledge. I'm not going to get them. Only because... I'm going to leave that for the next episode. I don't want to drag this one on too long. Uh, again, I want to try and keep it close to 45 minutes. So I'll explore it. I'm also going to look at some settings uh, on and around my PC. See if there's anything that I can fix. But before we reach Sigurd, we're going to try and explore. Nice chest here just for us. Also, oh, iron and leather. <laughs> we could have used that. We've got uh, much more of it now. Right, Stretch is there anything? Okay, so there are a lot of buildings around here. There's not anything up there. Uh, the Book of Knowledge isn't up there. It's in one of the, like, there's like a, a passage underneath. It might even be behind, maybe. But there's like a, a, a secret kind of underway that you can go through. Right, so we've been in this one. Uh, we'll, yeah, we'll just go through the village. Uh, I'll use own insight, see what there is around. See what it shows me to find. Oh, not a lot. <laughs> okay. Right, we'll go see what's over here. Again, skipping a lot of frames. Still confused as to why. But, no, no clue. The settings, are, the settings should still be turned down as they were before, and it was running almost perfect, 
the last episode and the one before after I edit it in the settings in the first uh, episode but you never know I might just have to turn them down again I definitely need to upgrade my PC uh, for sure um, but you know that's just something I guess I kind of have to deal with for now I do plan on upgrading my PC in the future somewhat uh, you know, it works. It works perfect for now. It might also be because I'm uh, recording, uh, which is taking a little bit of strain. When I loaded up uh, Assassin's Creed, it didn't load the first time, so I did have to load it twice, and that caused me to have to. Well, I had to task manager it, and when I task managed uh, the Assassin's Creed, it showed me obviously all the resources and stuff that you see on task manager advanced, and it showed me that I was using like. 100% CPU without Assassin's Creed opened, as well as uh, it showed me that I was doing no, nope, showed me that I was using like 80% uh, GPU, and my CPU yeah it's it's on the lower end I think it's well lower end, uh, it's an i5 7400, uh, and then my GPU is a GTX 1080. So there's my setup for you, if anyone was wondering. But it, it's just not running in great, and it, it I don't know, I'll have to see see cleaner it or something there. I don't know, run some, some anti-malware or spyware softwares on it. See if it can find anything that's taken a toll on my computer. Because, you know, I don't want you guys to have to deal with the subpar uh, content. I know it's, it's obviously not going to run perfect, my settings on OBS aren't perfect, uh, nothing ever really is, but you know I thought we were dealing pretty well with it up until now, when it seems to be having having some sort of anger issues or something, I haven't got a clue. We can get into this house, okay, oh that door's just not openable, right okay. Loot chest, nice. But all this <laughs> iron and leather might have been useful if we didn't get the two packs just now. But you know, it is it is what it is. We'll go see if there's a chest at the top of this one because there wasn't the last. Or no, there was arrows at the last, I believe. Ammo is full, and we have yeah. So 18 is our max. <laughs> see if there's anything at the top. Sometimes there's stuff at the bottom of them as well. But it kind of shows you. There's also sometimes uh, middle layers, depending on which ones you look at. What? No, I... <laughs> okay. Slide. Yay. Have I capped my frames? I do... Sorry. It's, it's really annoying. Field of view. What about full screen? Refresh rate, 60 native. That's weird, if anybody knows. My PC says it can do 100, uh, 75, sorry, as you see. But 65 is native. And I was told that native is the one that you want to go with. So, yeah, see, my graphics quality is low. It's, it's the lowest it can be. It definitely should not be running the way it was. I don't know why it was on borderless, but I play most of the games on borderless so that I can use obviously my other screen for other things. But uh, Assassin's Creed usually isn't on borderless because obviously, uh, oh it might have been on. I'll have to go back and check the other videos, it shouldn't have been on borderless because obviously I know it will run better in full screen. You reap a bloody harvest. Who are you, yes? Name yourself. I know his face, I met with your father not long ago. I did, indeed. I am Puthor, uncle to King Harold of the North. I speak for my nephew when there is need. This is not King Harold's land. Why does he send warriors so far south? You may ask him yourself, my lord. Oh, Thank he you, looks Lord. cute. <laughs> and you are Sirid of the Raven Clan, is that right? Son of the wise King Stirbjörn. I am. You are standing on his land, King Harold. Land we have reclaimed with blood and steel. That I see, and I honor it. For I have not come to war against you, but for you. A 
the request of your father. The canny wolf. Was this the plan he spoke of? I offer my support. With my warriors, your Raven clan can take Kirtway's fortress and settle this rivalry for good. This is good news, Abel. The Wandering King will tip our fortunes. We've got common cause, you know. Any we want to get rid of Kyotve. The end of Kyotve is a friend of mine. We thank you, King Harald. Your destiny will be repaid. This blood feud runs deep, King Harald. We welcome your help, but I must lead the charge. I of see. course. Is this a question of honor? It is. Many winters ago, Kyotve broke an oath to our fathers. He betrayed a friendly peace and slaughtered many. I understand. Sigurd Jarl will lead the assault against Kurtve and his clan, giving full command of my ships and my warriors. When your victory is in hand, Sigurd, find me at Alrekstadir, and we will celebrate together. Nice, we get to roll it, and we get all, uh, extra people. Will you join us? Hold the moment. You captain our longship, Abel. Meet us there, and we will claim Kurtve's head for the gods. Brother, I have waited too many years for this day. When Chudve stands before us, give me the final blow. You will have it, Eivor. You deserve it. <laughs> still, still gets me, you know. I don't know what it is about him. Give us a hand. Harald is generous with his troops. More than I would be. I cannot fathom his game. He's either a young fool, or deceptively wise. Whatever his reason, I have a good feeling this war is near its end. I hope so. I hope we can take him down. We all want Kyot Vagon. That's fine, that's fine, you know. Do it together. I don't think even in my playthrough I've uh, I've gotten to Kyotve yet. Unless you do Kyotve before England, I'm not sure. Right. So before I, so we have a new quest. I'm not going to do it this episode, but now we know what uh, we have for next episode, uh, which will be fun, and we leveled up even better. Well, we got loads of stuff to do. So, database, people, Harold. So, he's the, the king that we just met. Our quest, what's our next one? Part of battle for the Northern Way. Revenge and glory waits, be awaits behind Kyotve and the Cruel's Fortress Gates. Maybe we do get Kyotve before England. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we got stuff in our bag. A tooth. <laughs> okay. A tooth without a mouth may be useful if you lose one of your own. Yeah, sure, we'll just take somebody else's tooth. <laughs> no issues there. So obviously we're going to do these two. To get the, uh, the guided arrow. What's this? One adrenaline shot. And that unlocks... Chain Assassin. Ooh. Formulas through an axe at a second NPC standing in close proximity. <laughs> okay. Adrenaline shot unlocks something else over here. Oh, that will be cool for evasion. Yes, we want the guided arrows now. We're getting on, you know, 13 power. Uh, but yeah, so that is going to be the end of the episode. This one was a little bit longer, um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. I do apologise again for being tired <laughs> and yawning throughout the episode. And also for whatever's going on, uh, the textures were medium, I think. They may have been turned down to low. Uh, but last episode seemed to run a lot better than this, so I am going to clean my PC, um, as in storage-wise, and I'm also going to have to have a look at just everything <laughs> this is not right it should not be running this bad uh, so i'm gonna have a look at ways to optimize it but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed anyway 
Uh, make sure to catch me on Fridays. I stream every Friday, almost, um, from 6 until 10. That is UK time or GMT. I think it is. It might be you. Might be British Standard Time. I don't know. One of the two. Whenever the clocks go forward uh, by an hour, it's GMT. If they go back, it's British Scandinavian Time, I think. But yeah, so make sure to catch me there if you guys want more content like this. I don't play uh, solo player games. I like to leave that to the YouTube. Uh, but I play games like Valorant. That's a, a top favourite for me. Um, as well as, sometimes I'll play other games. I've also got a lot of games on the list for YouTube. I don't want to carry this on, uh, go through this first, but you never know. You might see another game pop up in the coming weeks. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit that. Uh, that for me. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I was meant to say. Hit the like button and smash the subscribe button. Uh, yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.